Hi, this is Tommy Hall with MathNook.com. I'm here to go over the addition, subtraction version of Laser Math. Okay, when you first start the game, this is a menu you'll see. You can click the uh, More Games. It'll take you to the MathNook website. Instructions will show you the instructions. It, you can either read them or watch this video by clicking this button here. And let's go ahead and click back and get back to the menu. Um, the music button will turn on the uh, music on and off. So let's go ahead and click the play button. It'll take you to the sub menu where you can choose to play the addition only game, the subtraction only game, or the addition and subtraction game. Uh, basically, they play the same. So let's just go ahead and uh, take a look at the addition game. And like I said, the other, game, the other levels play pretty much the same, except that this one has subtraction in it. This one has addition and subtraction in it. So let's go ahead and click the addition, take a look at it. And I've played through the five levels and I'm on the sixth level here but when you first start you'll only be able to play the first level and as you complete the first level then you'll be able to go on to the uh, next level and so on. Let's take a look at the first level and I'll show you how to play and this is a basic uh, very simple level and the object is to build an equation with the answer of five on this particular level so um, way you do that is you fire a laser and you want the laser to go t through two plus three and that would equal 5. So you're going to want to build that equation. If I just click Start now, the laser goes straight through and it says the equation must include the equal sign and answer and it shows that we really just had the laser go through 2 plus 3. So let's go ahead and set up a reflector to reflect the laser and the way I do that is click on any square well not any square, on this particular square but you could click on any square like on this one as I click keep clicking it goes around and you see on the uh, fifth click it disappears so uh, if I fire it now you're going to see it goes off the other way and it didn't make a valid equation so let's go ahead and click it and so that it, the laser should shoot out here go down there and make a valid equation and it tells us that we hit, were successful and it shows the equation we built and it did have an answer of 5 so we can go on the next level. So rather than go on the next level let's go ahead and go to the menu and I'll show you the, uh, let's take a look at the uh, sixth level here. Actually I want to look at the fifth level. Now this is uh, still a math problem. You've got to build an equation with answer of 16 but it kind of uh, gets into a puzzle problem too because you've got to figure out how you're going to build 16 with just three numbers. Well if you look at that and, and you know you can shoot the laser through uh, the plus sign a couple of times then you could actually build 5 plus 5 plus 6 is equal to 16. We've got to figure out a way to do that so what I'll do here is I'm going to set this up so we'll go through like let's set this up here so so far we have 5 plus and let's have it go back through 5 5 plus 5 and I'm going to need to go through the plus sign again so 5 plus 5 plus 5 plus and let's have it go through the 6 got to get around there put this down here because we need to go out, exit out here so we have 5 plus 5 plus 6, and that is equal to 16, but we've got to get the, go through the equal sign and the 1 and 6, so let's go ahead and do like that. We'll click that. Actually, I can't do that because I'd block that path. Let's go ahead and get rid of that. Uh, down like that. And like that, and it should be able to exit. So the path will be 5 plus 5 plus 6 is equal to 16. And it goes out that way. Let's see if it works. And it did. So that's how you play the game. Um, like I said, the other level, the subtraction and subtraction and addition levels play pretty much the same. Um, it's, it's a simple game. It's, it's, it's fun to play. It has a little math in it. It has a little puzzle action in there. So uh, I hope you enjoy playing it. And uh, thanks for watching.